Well, hello there everyone, Delta1 here, back with another multi-tool find just for you guys. So this one has some good news, and it's also got, unfortunately, a little bit of bad news, but uh, I'll show that to you uh, right now, actually. So we are in the space station, we are in the Euclid galaxy, you'll be able to see the portal glyphs at the bottom left of your screen, and the good news is, or at least part of the good news, is you don't have to do anything other than that, you just come to the system, fly up to the space station, and the multi-tool is going to be natively in this cabinet. So let's head up here, take a look, and there she blows. <laughs> That's a cool looking multi-tool, I think. It's an alien pistol called the Whispers of the Stars, V77K. Um, I mean, I was looking for multi-tools for a while before I found this one, uh, and so it felt like I was whispering to the stars when I found it, just pleading with them to let me find a cool multi-tool. And, hey, the stars answered, and here it is. So let's take a look at it. And there is the bad news right up here. It is unfortunately a C-class multi-tool, so you're not going to be able to get this natively as an S-class multi-tool. So that's the bad news there. Normally I wouldn't make a video about it, but I really like this multi-tool. It looks super cool. So let's take a look at it here. you got the left side view. you got the right side view. It is an alien pistol. I wouldn't call this configuration particularly uh, uncommon. You can find uh, this configuration out there, certainly on the Interstellar Index on Facebook and um, at the No Man's Sky Coordinate Exchange on Reddit. Uh, certainly with the teeth in the front, you got the shark's teeth up front and then the crystals in the back. A little harder to find the shark's teeth up front with the crystals in the back, but you can find it. You know, I think anybody out there can, can hunt for a while and find something like this. Uh, but the reason I'm posting a video for this is finding it in this color combination and this sort of uh, matching. It was harder to find on both the Interstellar Index and Reddit, so I thought I'd post this one even though it is a C-class. So what I'm talking about here is you got this orangish reddish body, uh, obviously the teeth and the shark's teeth uh, bones up front, uh, then you got the gray hardware which is pretty standard, but then you got a gray pommel, a gray clip, and a base gray for the crystal, so it's matching really really well, and then it fades into this orange here and this red here. It's a really well toned multi-tool. You can you can get you can look around for a while and sometimes you get a lot of different like multicolors or things that don't quite match on the multi tool. This one matches itself really well. I think it's clean. I think it's sleek. Um, and so while the stars answered my whispers uh, with a cool looking multi tool, unfortunately, it was not quite the class I would like. But hey, uh, with the updates to No Man's Sky, this isn't that big a problem. So what you can do if we back out here, if you pick up this multi tool, if you like it, hey guy, he waved at me. I should probably wait back, but I'm very rude. You go to the right here of this guy at the multi-tool uh, vendor, and you got the upgrade station. So you open up this upgrade station, and you have the option, once you click past all this little stuff here, to upgrade the class. Now you see next to it it says 50,000 nanites. That's because right now my character is rocking an S-class multi-tool. If you picked up that C-class multi-tool, this would say 10,000 nanites. Now to upgrade from a C to a B, it is, like I just said, 10,000 nanites. Then from a B to an A is 25,000 nanites, and an A to an S is 50,000 nanites. Now that's a boatload of nanites. That's 85,000 nanites. You know, who's got the time to get 85,000 nanites? I mean, that's a lot of nanites. Well, here's the thing. It's really not that many nanites. I'm currently working on a video to set up a farm for curious deposits, and that's a really good way to get a lot of nanites very quickly. You can get that 85,000 in under an hour if you'd like to. So if you're searching for nanites, you don't have any. Hey, uh, while you're waiting for my video to come up, search YouTube. There are plenty of tutorials out there to find nanites in a bunch of different ways. Uh, but hey, if you like the channel, uh, wait just a little bit and I'll get that video out as soon as I can. And you can even use the farm that I set up for you guys. So hey, did you guys like this video? Do you like this multi-tool? Do you like the content that's currently on the channel? Let me know in the comments below, especially if you're going to come and pick up this multi-tool. Like I said, I'm not going to make a habit of picking up these C-classes. I want to find the absolute best, best multi-tools, which are S-classes, out there for you guys. And unfortunately, this one is a native C-class uh, for the system. I did hunt around a bit, but uh, I got a few other multi-tools uh, out there that I'll post some videos on shortly. Uh, in the meantime, let me know what you think in the comments below. Uh, and until next time, I will see you guys out there in the verse. Have a good one, my friends.